Um, we have two awesome community guests to speak to tonight. The first of which is um, behind uh, a magazine you may have heard of. It's called Creating Genius. So we're here with Lee to talk about that. But before we start, I'm going to get you to pick out the fortune cookie of the week for us. Yeah, okay. Just anyone I want? Just anyone you like. This one. Awesome. Okay, can we get our fortune cookie handler, Alan, to come out? Thank you, Alan. <laughs> <laughs> Improvising. So what's going to happen is this fortune cookie is going to be handed to the person right at the back of our live audience. They are going to open the fortune but not show anybody. And we're going to play a game of telephone where that gets whispered along the line of people, almost like in a conga snake line. And it's going to reach the last person at the front, hopefully by the end of the episode. Um, and at that point, we're going to ask them what the fortune of the week is so it's going to be a good closer but moving back to Lee um, creating genius magazine for those who haven't heard of it before tell us a little bit about what's in it and, and, and what started it sure so creating genius magazine or CG magazine uh, it's a digital publication focused on the lifestyle of the entrepreneur so you know, our content is revolves heavily around that entrepreneurs business leaders creative thinkers uh, and entrepreneurs are naturally they're big thinkers they're dreamers and we want to help dreamers become doers and be a potential catalyst for their rise to the top. That's super awesome. So you profile some pretty big names in entrepreneurship as well as up and coming people, right? Yeah, we've been reaching out to a lot of people, especially in downtown Vegas and across the country um, with a big entrepreneur scene. I guess San Francisco, New York, Austin. Um, and that's been half the fun, reaching out to these people, hearing their stories, uh, where they're going and then sharing that with people who want to listen. This is a super cool magazine. Yeah. So what, what really makes me happy is that because obviously you live in Vegas, you're profiling a lot of Las Vegas entrepreneurs that don't always get that spotlight because you know it's normally all about Silicon Valley, right? Yeah, we've been, um, it's been interesting downtown Las Vegas. We have a national reach, but you know, 85% of our distribution is in, is in Las Vegas. So you know, with the growing entrepreneur scene and the growing tech startups, um, you know, the local magazines already here haven't really tapped into that, so you know there's a big opportunity for a CG magazine to showcase the entrepreneurs. I like that a lot. Yeah. And so, how did this magazine get started in the first place? I hear it was kind of this really lovely organic growth that, that yeah. came about I mean, through I serendipity. <laughs> I want to say collisions. I mean, you hear that in downtown, but mm -hmm. you know that's just another collision story. Um, I was working with some startups downtown with at work in progress and uh, doing a lot of content, ran into a, a really creative designer and publisher, Michael Durant. Mm -hmm. um, I was doing a lot of content for him and a blog got traction. We kind of spun that off into its own separate entity and then uh, yeah, Creating Genius kind of evolved from that into something really, really cool. I love that a lot because having that kind of growth organically creates that genuine audience yeah, and that kind definitely. of thing. So um, how often do you release issues and when is the next one coming out? Yeah, so we're releasing on web this coming Tuesday, July 8th, and you know after that we're going to go digital, um, which is going to be on iPads and on mobile, and that's going to be a little more formal with a lot of design. That's going to be in September, mm -hmm. and after that it'll be one issue every two months. Um, up until that point, you can go to cgeniuslife.com, C with C Genius, um, join the waiting list until Tuesday, or just go on Tuesday and, uh, and check us out. Every two months is an impressive effort because I, yeah. I definitely see what goes on behind the scenes when making a magazine. So yeah, that's really, yeah, really awesome. Especially with the small team that we have. It's, it's a lot of work, but it's, uh, it's too much fun to, to stop. So. <laughs> awesome. And I hear that we've got a little bit of crossover in the podcast family too right. with contributing. Definitely. We, are, are, we have a growing list of contributors. Uh, we are looking for more, but um, we've been making a lot of the right connections and right partnerships. And we've actually partnered with Downtown Podcast, and Evelyn over here is a, a regular contributor, and it's, it's worked out really well. Downtown Podcast will have their own section um, inside the magazine, and uh, you know, we both have the same goals. We're doing the, we complement each other, so a, a partnership just makes sense. That's really cool. Yeah. I'm going to have to ask Evelyn about that yeah, in a definitely. second. Awesome. Well, thank you so much, sure. and um, I hope people um, check out your website to actually read your zine, if you want to give that to the audience just one more time. Yeah, cgeniuslife.com, C with the C, cgenius. Awesome. Yeah. Thank Woo. you so much. All right, thank you. Yeah. Cool.